Hello, this is James here for GamerGuides.com and today I'm going to talk to you about the wetsuit and diving for underwater creatures in Animal Crossing New Leaf for the Nintendo 3DS. The wetsuit is a new tool in Animal Crossing New Leaf and it opens up a new collectible. In past games you had the bugs and the fish, now you have more creatures, now you have the underwater creatures that you need the wetsuit to find. To get the wetsuit you first need to unlock the tropical island by talking to Tortima and then once you're here you have a 25% chance of the wetsuit being on sale and then you need 40 medals from the island minigames to buy one. That said, before you buy one, you can actually rent one here on the island by talking to Lloyd, who was the guy I was talking to just over there. So, how do you actually use the wetsuit? It's rather simple. You put it on, walk up to this ocean, and then simply press A and you'll wade in. And now, you got to swim around. What we're looking for are underwater shadows. You can also see them by looking for bubbles rising to the surface. Now, when you first enter the water, I tend to find you have to swim around a bit. I gather that the game doesn't spawn these creatures unless you are actually in the water, just to save itself some effort. So once you get in the water, it starts going, oh, I've got to spawn these guys now. So you might take a little bit of swimming, but yeah. There's also jellyfish that will swim around. They'll sting you. It doesn't really have any effect, aside from just being a nuisance, but try and avoid them. So what do you do when you see an underwater shadow? Well, rather simple. You swim towards it by tapping A to swim, and then you press Y to dive. What you're trying to do is sort of swim over it and try and dive onto it. If you miss though, you can keep tapping A underwater, and if you keep doing this, you will eventually have a bit of a speed surge. So it doesn't matter if you miss on the initial dive, because there are a lot of pretty swift underwater creatures that you will miss. So just try and make sure that you're getting over it so that your dive lands you as close as possible and then start swimming towards it and struggling towards it underwater and you get the hang of it. Another thing worth noting is that you can scare away fish whilst you're swimming like this. So if you say see a shark and you really want to catch the shark, give it a wide berth when you're coming back to shore and then you'll try and avoid scaring it. But yeah, there's not much else more to the wetsuit, apart from one one thing, which is quite fun, is that you can dive off cliffs. Whoa, look at that, amazing. So yeah, enjoy your wetsuit, and don't forget to check out the full guide on gamerguides.com.